In one of my recent videos, I have shown you that I've been fixing the network cables in this house so that it would be integrated within the building. It's time for me to install that Netgear access point that I've shown you before. I wanna maximize the capability of that Wi-Fi device. So we are covering three floors actually with one access point. So jump in, I'm going to show it to you. This is the living room and then we have the uh, rooms up there and pretty much the access point that we have can cover this whole area. We are going to drill that one. Yeah, of course, we need to measure the placement of the net gear with that mounting plate that comes with the box and then kind of mark where we're going to drill it. Then drill it, put in the tox, prepare the screw so that we can screw the mounting plate. And take note that this net gear has already been configured in my previous video. So plug in the LAN cable, plug in the power cable, then of course slide it in, it will lock, power it up, then plug the cable also to that port that we have patched before that it's powered in okay so you will have an indicator that the LAN cable is active and somebody is already connected which is my phone so what i'm going to do here is do the speed test like what i did before and i'm not joking with you guys when you see this speed test my connection is 100 megabits per second but with this speed test, you can see it's 400 plus. And I ain't kidding you guys. See, there you go. See, I am at five gigahertz and that's my ping. You can see 408. We are at a maximum speed. Okay, so the next thing we gotta do, fix the cables. That's how simple it is how to mount those uh, access point. And yeah, I'm happy that I'm going to use it already because Imagine that 400 plus megabits per second, that would be very fast for a home use kind of scenario. So if you have any questions, just don't forget to comment down below, like this video of course, and of course if you're not subscribed, subscribe to my YouTube channel. All right, see ya.